continuing to put up fierce resistance in the face of continuous assaults. These images, reportedly recorded on Friday, show some of the last Ukrainian defenders of Avdivka before their retreat. The largely ruined town is strategically important to both sides, located close to the Russian-controlled city of Donetsk. But the Ukrainian defenders have gradually found themselves pressed from three sides, with an increasing danger of being surrounded. We have a complicated situation with the enemy trying to penetrate our defense. In some other places the situation is critical as the enemy is trying to bypass our troops. We're forced to fight 360 degrees around us. The extent of the destruction can be seen in this video, released by a Ukrainian YouTuber reportedly filmed last week. A district of Avdivka has been completely ravaged by Russian bombs. It all happened in the past two weeks. You can't recognize Avdivka. Practically everything has been flattened by bombs, including the local residents who are in the basements. The Russian army spares nobody. Ukraine has been willing to fight these so-called meat grinder battles, making the grim calculation that with Russia losing far more soldiers, they are worth it. But as with the battle for Bakhmut last year, which Kyiv finally gave up, the desire to save Ukrainian lives seems to be more important. A symbolic victory for Russia, Ukraine will hope this defeat could act as a wake-up call for its allies, who've been warned now for weeks that a shortage of ammunition would lead to such a loss, and that unless things change, more defeats can be expected. Over many months of fighting, the civilian population of Avdivka has mostly been evacuated, but remarkably, some people remain, surviving in basements. And as Ukrainian soldiers pull back, their fate and that of their town now in Russian hands. Rob McBride, Al Jazeera, Kharkiv, Ukraine. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.